Get your smartphones, get your tablets, and get your laptops out because the Wi-Fi is back online. The Montreal Canadiens have recalled defenseman Arbor Jacai from the Laval Rocket. That is right, baby. The Sheriff is back in town. And this is a video that we could go out there and make with a number of ideas in mind. We can talk about the roster moves because today the Canadiens also announced that they had sent Justin Barron down to Laval and Mitchell Stevens has been placed on waivers. But instead of this idea being the main thing, what I wanted to go over was Arbor Jacai just in general and what he's been like in the Laval Rocket for the AHL. It's pretty good, actually, this entire Justin Barron Mitchell Stevens thing. We could talk about that tomorrow a little bit. But for now, let's talk about Arbor. Because when it comes to Jacai and the way that he's played in the Laval Rocket, it's kind of funny, but the last few games that he played for Laval were against the Belleville Senators on the 19th and the 20th. Now, he's going to be coming up to Montreal just in time to help the Canadians play off against the Ottawa Senators. So he plays two games against Belleville, he'll play a game against Ottawa, it's a big Laval Senators, Canadian Senators thing. So Arbor being involved in both of these will be a nice physical force to be reckoned with. But we recognize that for Arbor Jacai and his performance in Laval, what I really do appreciate, other than, of course, the point production, 11 points, 17 games played, 3 goals, 8 assists, and, to top it all off, 34 penalty minutes, he literally averaged a minor penalty a game. What I really appreciated about Jacai's time in Laval was that he didn't whine or complain about it at all. He got sent down, he suited up, he did the work, and he shut up about it. He didn't have any entitlement, he didn't play like he knew he was an NHL guy in the past. This guy just did what he needed to do, and he stood up for his teammates, he fought as much in the AHL as we're used to seeing in the NHL, he polished his offensive game a little bit, and it's really great to see a young guy who already has a full season's worth of NHL time under his belt because he had 17 games played this season, 51 games played last season, added together, it's roughly a full season, just under if you wanted to say that. Even if he was already considered an NHL guy, the fact that he got sent down and he just did the work as necessary proves that his work ethic is in a great spot. And hopefully, this stint in Laval was good enough to help him just stabilize his NHL play. Part of the reason he got sent down in the first place was because of irresponsible penalties. He would be debatably a little bit too aggressive. He had more penalty minutes in 17 games in the NHL than he did in the AHL. Even though you could say the AHL is a rougher and tougher, more physical league, Arbor Jacai was able to rein himself back in a little bit and actually listen to the assignments that the Canadians most likely had for him. Hey, stop taking dumb penalties and just play the game the right way. And of course, the 11 points in 17 games definitely helps. So now Arbor Jacai is back in Montreal going down. You've got a few extra names like Justin Barron. It's going to be interesting to see where the Canadians go with this, but I will say preview for tomorrow's video because, you know, I wanted to talk mostly about Jack High in this one. Tomorrow's video, we're going to be talking about Josh Waugh as well as Jaden Struble because the fact that you had these guys in particular that got sent down and not those other two that we talked about, that's significant. So for now, let me know your thoughts on the Wi-Fi coming back online. Sheriff's back in town, baby. Arbor Jack is making his return to the Montreal Canadiens just in time to play off against the Ottawa Senators just nights after playing off against both of the baby Senators teams. Thoughts in the comment section below. I hope you enjoyed this British Rose 9 and bye.